<laughs> row, row. There you go, you obstacle. Welcome back, everybody, to Tales of Graces F. Last time, we found ourselves in an alien world, which apparently, uh, our world, Aphinius, orbits. Yes. This is the humanoid or like it's moon. Center? It's water moon. The water moon. I will warn you again. If you value your lives, please use extreme caution while inside Don't this facility. Don't boss me, woman. I just hope their machine still works so we can help Sophie. Come on. Sophie's fine. Let's get her and her giant watermelon. I mean, Sophie still works and she's a machine, apparently. She is a machine. She's very, very, uh, so well quiet. <clears throat> oh, look, Tiger All Festival. All here is my heartbeat. Tiger but Festival's kind of creepy. I'm still alive. Trust will only betray. Hope will only disappoint. We must remove all hope and return it to the planet. To the planet's soul, Lambda. Oh, okay then. So apparently the planet's soul is Black Mesa. That's good to know. Let's go ahead and warp, because, you know, why not? Research. Oh, very, very uh, pumped music here. Very energetic. It's kind of like some other place we've seen before. I was going to say, it certainly does look a bit familiar, but it's this freaking game. Everyone stay on your game. Oh, I got poisoning. There's a problem. You're not using enough lightning. Yeah, the enemies around here are a bit tougher. Man. I don't think we had any fights on this, uh... In this world last time, but this time we are, of course, and uh, these things take quite a beat. I think we had one or two fights last time. I don't know if we really killed anything except for what was out the door. It's over. Darn it, got the four bucks. Now we don't have a meter yet. Uh, <laughs> We won't fail! Woo, we won. We won't fail because we'll do an ether burst and do two of those things. Killer needle. Something was upgraded. Well, that's neat. Let's see. No new, no new uh, things yet. Oh, skip. There you go. This wall is a little different from the walls around it. So that could mean... That it's a retractable shutter. If that's the case, then there must be a device somewhere that controls it. Yes, that's fine. How about your face? It. All right. Dim's all you're doing. The, you're going the wrong way. You need to go here and flip a switch first. Okay. So, that, <laughs> that was, was interesting. <laughs> the portal is uh, <laughs> the is portal alarmed. is shocked. <laughs> what? Somebody just came through me. It can be interpreted the wrong way. <laughs> Do not enter a... Uh, oh, no! Ow, ow, ow. Do not enter portals without the consent. <laughs> we didn't yell surprise first. That's good. <laughs> I'm just getting gangbanged in there, and now I'm dead. And I'm alive! Yep. Thank you, food. Why are these potatoes poisoned? <laughs> Whoa! They're just past their prime. I mean, everything on this world is a past just expiration date. That's true. Edge of the void. Hold on, everybody. Be right back. Right, and we're back. We had a bunch of flexibles. They were quite delicious. Uh, you performed reasonably as well. Chocolate yes, you ate that that bunchicle very well. <laughs> That was pretty tasty. All right, so we've interacted with the computer, and that door should be open now. So we just we just watched what we did at the beginning, and there was a little bit of time that we didn't realize we were recording. Well, I knew it was in there. <laughs> I just didn't care. You will survive. So it's it's there. I don't care. I don't want to start over again. <laughs> Okay, 
Now, I'm not a real big fan of that, like, whirlwind spin. It has a ten, uh, tendency to miss. How is that? My regards! For your mother. <laughs> Not word your mother, my regards. My regards to your mother. Well, I'm stunned. God, you're frazzled. Freaking poison. Come here, you. Plenty of Move room for down. improvement, but we can let it slide. Shut up, Hubert. <laughs> That's all I got to say to that. I guess so. Uh, what does this do? I just like my fancy new weapon. Which I'm pretty sure we got last time, but... We haven't really had a chance to see in battle too oh, much. Oh, these are batteries. These are dead ones, I think. Oh, no, these are charged ones. Take the charged battery. I think we can only take one. Yep, can only take one. Dumb. They're just so heavy, and uh, you know, multiple people have to <laughs> haul around this one. <laughs> We're all. Everyone, get a get a hand in. More. All right. Let's see. Can I put it in here. Yep. Mm -hmm. Probably pick up another one. Yeah, you know, because you know, it's gonna be like that. <laughs> Are you gonna be like that game? It is Seriously. gonna be like that. <laughs> How do we even know these are batteries? Um, um, they say Duracell so on. <laughs> you just can't see them from any of the angles we see them on the camera. I don't think use Energizer, damn it. I don't know. Maybe they just didn't buy the ad campaign or something. <laughs> <laughs> this is a dumb puzzle. <laughs> this is a puzzle. Uh huh. How do I how do I plug in batteries? Rare metal. Let's go and get rid of that now. I think we have enough rare metal. Mixer rare metal. Goodbye. Now torch flame. Ah, I don't think we have enough of those. Only fifty. What do we have zero of? Golden bow. Fine wood. <laughs> a lot of things. Elegant feathers, we have none of. As well as all those things. Let's get a dark shine crystal. Okay. And we're off. <laughs> what is going on in here? Anything? Probably another battery. Chamber. Oh god! It also has a star in it. I like how that thing just disappeared. I wish it was in this scene. <laughs> just like spinning in circles, flailing its little limbs. Yep. <clears throat> what is this? What did we just pick up? I wasn't paying attention. God damn it. <laughs> You're too busy worrying about the tentacles. Also, I was thirsty. Of course. Yes. <laughs> yes, she is making <laughs> jokes at your choice of eyewear. Hers is clearly superior. <laughs> the only way this could have been better is if we both had them wearing those swim goggles. <laughs> You're making fun of my eyewear. You're wearing the same thing. Yeah, but it looks horrible on you. <laughs> Who wore it better? <laughs> uh, Are you guys done with this whole right? conversation Jesus yet? Christ. Quite precarious. I don't think you can just quit being a ruler. Can you do that? <laughs> Fuck y'all, I resign. <laughs> I don't want to do this anymore. I abdicate this shit right now. <laughs> But we're not even at war. I don't care. I'm going home. But the castle is your home. Damn it. <laughs> they drive you, huh? Okay. A unit that drives. Oh, and we got rid of the thing by having a cutscene in the same room. Well, that's good. They got bored of that scene, too. <laughs> it was like, uh, Who are these people talking to? Jesus Christ. 
I'm gonna go somewhere fun where there's battles. I'm leaving. Or at least voice cutscene. <laughs> right? Scorpion. Ah, oh, it waggled right to our base. I don't think we're gonna get another one. We might. Oh, it was so close. I wonder if we can bank those by not using them. I bet we can. That'd be useful if we did this. We should probably do that so that way we can save it for the bosses. Okay. That way once we, you know, get one, we can do like 12 times like I did in that first boss. No one can stand before my blade. You remember. Yep. Onion. Apparently on this, this world it's completely desolate. There's onions still. Oh, and there's grapes. Didn't we find grapes Oh, here? we did find grapes. That's true. That is true. What is this? Maven of the Sword. You can now download packages for your sword. It runs Java. <laughs> this is my Java sword. It runs on all the OS's and platforms. <laughs> He's all I'm changing in here. God damn it! Get out! Get out! Get out! <laughs> Spellbook that halves the amount of gold you return to stores a proportional amount of Aleph. Eh, worthless. That might be useful if we were in a pinch. It'd be useful if we were actually using that other book that, like, uh, blocked us from damage. Yeah, maybe. Uh, screw that book. <laughs> screw you, scorpions! And we need to go place our hands on another computer. Yeah. Because fun, everybody! Oh, because the puzzers. fun. The puzzeroos. Got an Aleph bottle C from it. No, don't touch me. <laughs> It's flailing wildly. Interesting. Like, our cameras had to uh, change positions there for no particular reason. Oh, like that. Just to fuck us into this, I guess. Ow. Stop it. Ah, I'm poisoned. <laughs> yeah, you're kind of getting gangbanged. Why is everything attacking me? Must have said something uh, disparaging about their mother. I must have. I don't know. Man, even when I block, they do something like 273 damage. The scorpions? No, just these little tentacle demons. Oh, that was cool. I've never done that move before. Oh, I'm gonna die. Never mind. Kill it. Kill it with fire. I can't our baby Hubert got so strong. <clears throat> Please don't mention my past in front of everyone. I don't want anyone to know I was a baby. <laughs> I was just grown up when I came out of a I came out grown up. <laughs> I never peed myself. <laughs> Oh, Hubert. Let's get out of here. Battery. Now, I know I'm hoping for a lot. I know I'm hoping for a lot here, but I hope this is the last time we need to plug in a battery. No, we got two more at least. Why, because there's two more batteries? Yeah, exactly. Well, at least we have a quick way up to this floor, so we can get these batteries. <sighs> <laughs> yeah. Great puzzle, everybody. I was gonna say, in the old days, they'd have you backtrack your way all the way. All the way. And then I stabbed them in the mouth. Did you? Because I'm pretty sure they kept doing it. No matter how much you stabbed them in the mouth. <laughs> <laughs> they liked it. Well, there's your problem. Well, that was dumb. At least the music's interject in this place. That's all I got. That's true, I guess. It's kind of a boring place. 
Most of the dungeons actually have been in this game, I have to say, in comparison to many of the ones we've seen in the past. I got a rare scabbard. This one's a limited edition, comes with a certificate of authenticity. <laughs> Is it numbered? Yes, it's number seven. Excellent. Of uh, 100. Only 100 were produced. Scabbard created from a new type of metal that was recently uncovered by earthquakes on a different world. Trying to think of something clever to put in there, but I just can't. That's too dumb. <laughs> well, we got a save point. Maybe that means something exciting will happen. No. I know I'm asking for a lot, oh, but maybe. Oh, I saved over the wrong one. Well, I hopefully now that footage goes wrong. But well. <laughs> right? Yeah. Hmm. 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 Leave me alone. Damn it, I'm trying to change it here. Oh, an old divide. Excellent, excellent. My favorite. Oh. I like that burst of dance. There's a lot of dance. At least it seems. Fire. There we go, that's my Oh, you son of a wow. Yep. And I was stunned out of the air. Don't do that, they have a good batting average. <laughs> Apparently. There you go, I killed it. I avenged you, brother. Yay. God. Damn it! A vengeance Go to the is mine. academy, sure. <laughs> then you can get your batch. All right, let's go ahead and head back in here now. Boss fight. Oh, I hope so. <laughs> We're gonna have to fight Sophie this to make her better. Just like that machine <laughs> from the ruins beneath Wallbridge. This device preserves visual recordings of research targets. I'm hoping to see some graphs on here. These are our targets for this year. <laughs> as you can see, we're not earning as much as we should be. Oh, hey, there's that word again. What does it mean, anyway? Lambda. Everybody the die! World, Lambda has come to mean nightmare. Why is that? Because reasons. Lambda is a life form we discovered by accident while researching the Lestalia. When the Institute's director, Professor Cornell, began to study it, What's the story it again? quickly became a nightmare for us all. The worst aspect of Lambda, and there are many, is an ability to hatch monsters from its body. Well, that's neat. These Weird. monsters threw Fodra into chaos, and eventually led to its destruction. That cocoon! It looks just like the one that appeared at World's Eye. After wreaking havoc here, Lambda fled to your world of Aphinia. We knew Lambda had to be stopped, so we created a humanoid capable of fighting it and initiated pursuit. Protos Initiation Hase. pursuit. That humanoid is Protos Haste, yeah. the one you call Sophie. That's the incorrect name. You should call Protos, Protos Haste. Haste was unable <laughs> to destroy Lambda. Protos haste means watermelon in our language. After much discussion, <laughs> we surviving Fodrans chose to seal off Aphinia in the hopes of containing Lambda there. Good but job. Now, after so many years, the Aphenians have come to us. So it would seem. So you built Sophie and then sent her to our world so she could defeat Lambda. That's what she just said. Does that mean Lambda is the one who created the cocoon? But wait, that doesn't make sense. I mean, Richard made the cocoon. Maybe Lambda knows how Oops. to disguise itself or something. Maybe it just looks like Richard. Or maybe it has possessed him and is hatching monsters. I refuse to believe that Richard and Lambda are the same. I know Richard. He's not a monster. He's not he a monster. Be. He's a nice lady. <laughs> what? <laughs> Sophie's getting worse. Is she? I guess she is glowing less. It's hard we to tell from this distance. It is. I agree. Come on. And nothing happened. Okay, apparently. can we fix 
Can we fix Sophie? I want to no. play a Sophie again, please. No. You get to be. I like punching stuff. <laughs> oh. oh well, that was a thing. Toy blocks? What's what that? Toy blocks here? with our book. Interesting. Cornell used those as part of his research. Cornell? Was he related to this facility? Correct. Cornell was a foremost researcher of humanoid development, a key mind in the field of biotechnology. Um, is this Cornell person still alive? I'm afraid not. From my understanding, Cornell died before the Great War began in Fodra. However, his research lived on, and was the foundation for many spectacular breakthroughs. It truly is a shame that such an accomplished individual such as he would lead such a short-lived life. Asbel, Sharia, we should move on. Yes, of course. She's all, I wasn't done yet. I like to imagine they were built like a little city and we just came and hit him with our book. Knocked him over. Yeah, we are sort of dicks. Anyway. Now what? Onwards. Towards victory. Also, maybe boss battle. <gasps> oh, she's sparkly now. That's That can't be good. She's going critical. I thought she was a vampire. Down. Oh, she might Excuse be a vampire. Me. Richard's the, or Tiger Festival's the only vampire in this game. Of individual particles that act in concert with each other. She needs blood. These She's made of nano machines. Than a grain of sand, <laughs> come together to form a human shape. My God, Snake! <laughs> Snake's gonna have a fucking heart attack. The particles also possess the ability to separate from each other, which is what you see happening right now. Oh. Actually, you should say Prudos Hayes. <laughs> Asbel, Sharia, what's happening? We're made out of nano machines. Hey, what's going on, you guys? We're in the club. It's the result of a you process called distributive preservation. Your friends must be completely synchronized with Protos Hayes' particles. I don't understand. When Protos Haste suffers heavy damage, it usually splits into individual particles, shuts down all functionality, and begins the process of reconstruction. Seven years this later. This is known as particle preservation. Distributive preservation, on the other hand, allows Protos Haste to implant its particles into one or more separate vessels. Have you ever seen Protos Haste split into particles like this? Anyone? Bueller? Bueller? <laughs> that must be what happened seven years ago. But, the unit shouldn't actually engage that procedure. Why not? The reason being, distributed preservation makes it much more difficult for the particles to reform. They get stuck in their ways. Failure could render reformation impossible so why would protos haste have risked entering that state would her particles have any kind of effect on the vessels that they went into yes in fact while the particles prepare for reconstruction they would repair any damaged areas of the vessel as well so sophie split herself into three parts and then used those parts to save asbel sharia and little bro but then that means Sophie didn't die after all. She was just recuperating within us. My whole life is a lie. It's amazing. She's been with us this whole time. I see. Then this would explain why we possess some of the same powers she has. That's why we can do parts. <laughs> so we can do parts. So, we can do parts before she died, though. No, those aren't real parts. No. Distributive they were fake parts. Does yep. not allow for reconstruction of the self. She would lose all elements of her current identity. No. Sophie, you risked your life for us. Impossible. Protos Haste was never designed for this kind of self-sacrifice. Ghost in the machine. I fear further particle breakdown could be disastrous. We must hurry. Before she completely evaporates in a poof of nanomachines. Host to the light. What time is it? Should probably end this episode soon. 
We were expecting a boss fight or something, but no, it's just this damn place. With its neon tater tots covered with glow-in-the-dark smudges. Mm. God damn it, tater tots. No one loves you. That's all I'm gonna detonate. They give your mom my regards. <laughs> Thank you, man. Very hard. I thought I was doomed, but we worked together. My regards. Well, the heal, dumbass. Good. The beef curry brought you back to life. Okay, no one do anything to me. We already have three? How do we get three? Um, no rage. Oh, I guess we'll save him. Might be able to save uh, an old divide if we don't do that. Ow. Victory is ours. <laughs> hey, and since we did the challenge, I actually got full HP. Hooray. I was just making sure your title was changed. Okay. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Well, we got one of those again. Golden bow. Let's see what's on the other side. Okay. Just because I'm curious. That'll happen. Hello, scorpion. Oh, get over here. More batteries! Oh. Nope, there is a little girl in a canister. Hooray. Roll, is that you? Oh, there's a chest in here. I guess that's all that's in here other than that. Elegant feather! Hooray! <laughs> that was worth it. I guess. Yeah, well, since you mentioned Roll, it actually reminds me of, like, one of the few Kickstarters I've actually engaged in. I think you've engaged in it as well, and that's the Mighty Number no. 9. It looks like it's coming along very well. I have, indeed. I'm, uh, very Back impressed with that one. Mm -hmm. I was gonna say, I'm very impressed with its, uh, Mega Man X-like, uh, gameplay. Yeah. Plus, it has, like, ledge grabbing and, uh, this new Absorb feature. Yeah, it looks pretty good, from what I've seen of it, as well. The character's design is pretty awesome. Also back to another one called Time Spinner. Looks pretty cool too. What was that one about? It's like a 2D Metroidvania type of game. Okay. Did I go to the right? I think board? you did show me that one. Or at least I saw it before. Mm, I'm, I'm, I posted it on Twitter as well. Okay, that's probably so where I saw it. Maybe that's where you saw it, yeah. That's right, folks. Zephy has a Twitter account, so if you want to hear his ramblings, that's where to hear it. I did. Today I rambled I, a little bit. It's true. <laughs> Apparently I work in the ghetto. I walked outside and there were shoes hanging off the power lines. Kids still do that. Just tie together the laces and throw them up there, and then the other kids all wag as dicks. And then you can't even get them with, like, a pole, because then you might kill yourself. <laughs> <laughs> with a pole? <laughs> I don't know. Those power lines are pretty high up. You'd have to go to, like, Home Depot and get a, a yeah, really long a really pole. big pole. Uh, Maybe a ladder with an extender. Shoes really aren't worth that much. <laughs> uh, now, apparently a couple is fighting over there. Yeah. There was some other couple fighting. It was... It was, uh, it was pandemonium. I mean, the subway that I walked to was only, like, two blocks away, so... This is, all, this is everything I see. On my way to Subway. I was gonna say, when we when you say Subway, you actually mean the restaurant, not the conveyance. Yes, I do mean the restaurant. I was gonna say, I don't think we have any Subways in Colorado. I don't think so. We have light rails, but that's, that's not as close as we get. Yeah, light, light rails and elevated trains. And they're useful if you're around. Yeah, they are. Darn you damn things, don't you slow. To get downtown, they're not too bad. Yeah, or if you're actually in downtown. Yeah. Okay, stop being eloquent. There you go. <laughs> Keep juking their, their spider webs. Whoa. Whoa. Stop killing my brother. You neon tater ton of dude. Blue green. Red, blue, green. She found some RGB cables over there. That's good. There she goes again. All right.
right. I don't even know what we're doing. Uh, trying to succeed at life in playing this game. Hello, other android. No, leave me alone. Collection of nano machines, whatever you are. Damn it, there's a chest in there. Are the other <laughs> humanoids, are they collections of nano machines? I would assume so. <laughs> they must be. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Well, stop doing that. I'm trying. Do you need some help over there? I want you to see the freaking gel since they're stupid. <laughs> yeah, since Sherry is fighting instead of helping me. You're about to die too. I'll be fine. Safe Because there's courage. <laughs> also, I'm poisoned. I am going to die. <laughs> Sweet. I guess three is the maximum, so let's just go wild. <laughs> I'm trying to go wild. There we go. That's a damn bitch. That's a bunch of people. I didn't realize she was actually like turning into those things she summoned. That was weird. Did she turn into it? She like disappeared during that summon. Huh. I wasn't really, I haven't been able to pay attention to her while she's doing it. I just see everything like shoot across the screen. <laughs> Doings just transpire and you don't exactly. pay attention. Alright everyone, that's what we're going to leave off for today. Next time we may get to something quite exciting. We'll see you then. We'll see.